The past few weeks have been incredibly difficult and challenging for our country and for our people. People are rightly worried about their health and the health of loved ones. Our economy has taken a huge shock in recent weeks with hundreds of thousands of people losing their jobs. People are now worried about paying the mortgage, paying their rent, paying their next bill and worried about when they will return to employment again. Our politics too have changed. We have all left our comfort zone. And I know that the notion of Fianna Fáil even entering discussions with Fine Gael uh, is a very challenging one for an awful lot of our members. In the last number of weeks, against the backdrop of COVID-19, we have entered discussions with Fine Gael with a view to agreeing a framework document. We have now agreed that document and we hope that it will form the foundation of a negotiation of a programme for government over the weeks ahead. In those negotiations so far, we have remained true to the core values and principles of Fianna Fáil and we have upheld the policies that we campaigned on in the general election in February. We want to see a real emphasis on affordable housing and tackling homelessness. We want to see universal access to healthcare. We have always been the party of education and that features strongly in the document that we have agreed. We hold true and dear the aspiration of working towards a united Ireland by consent. That is reflected in this document and we reaffirm Ireland's role as a member of the European Union and our commit commitment to the Union even in the post-Brexit world that we are about to enter. In the next number of years we are going to face as a country great challenge in rebooting the Irish economy. That will require an ambitious and a radical national economic recovery plan. Fianna Fáil has a huge amount to offer in that regard. We want to assist businesses to refloat, to get back up and running, to getting Irish people back to work and to deal with the challenges that they all face in their day-to-day -day lives. There are so many issues that need to be tackled, including the climate and biodiversity emergency, which has not gone away despite the enormous step back that our economy and the global economy has taken uh, over the last number of weeks. Political parties should want to be in government, especially at a time of huge challenge. Parties should want to be there leading from the front, dealing with the issues that really matter to the people that we all represent. We are up for that challenge and what we ask of each and every one of you is to have a close and careful look at the document that we have agreed and ask yourself is it true to the values of Fianna Fáil and what we hope to achieve if we do enter government. With your support we want to enter into negotiations in the weeks ahead with Fine Gael at a more detailed level and other parties too to form a new government that will provide strong and stable leadership for this country over the next number of years. That government needs to have Fianna Fáil at the heart of it. I want to thank you all for your ongoing commitment and support for our party. These are extraordinarily tough times for our country. We will come through this. Fianna Fáil has an enormous role to play in helping our country uh, to recover from this, both as a society and as an economy. Let's work together to achieve that. Thank you very much.